It is an all too common part of summer. The sun comes out, the shirts come off and the suntan lotion doesn't always go on. Just one of the reasons that skin cancer is now the fifth most common cancer in the UK. Richard Cumberland is one of 13,000 people diagnosed every year. Now he avoids the sunlight as far as possible. In March of last year I noticed that the lymph nodes were swollen. So there's clearly some involvement there. They were operated on and it was hoped that it, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't spread further. But by September it had spread and was in this shoulder, this trapezius muscle in the shoulder and in the spine. Now in a breakthrough that may baffle many, but one which has gripped the medical world. After years of intense research, scientists have discovered that a genetically modified form of the colsal virus herpes can significantly reduce patients' tumours and in the short term even remove them altogether. These patients had melanoma that was inoperable and there was no other treatment that these patients could receive. These patients were treated either with a virus or a controlled immune therapy. What we were able to see was that the patients who received the virus had a significantly higher level of response. We saw some patients in whom the disease did not come back again for more than three years. And so we can begin to hope for those patients that they may actually have long-term disease-free interval and they may be cured of their disease. Equally as important, this is a treatment that could be available in just 12 months. It will bring hope to a lot of people because I'm in the position of having more hope than people before me because it was a terrible diagnosis some years ago and with no hope at all. The advice as ever is to cover up and to keep skin protected where possible but in terms of fighting the war against cancer and helping patients like Richard, today's announcement is a huge step forward. Claire Ashforth, 5 News.